How to install Android 11 Developer Preview 1 on your Xiaomi Poco F1. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Android 11 Developer Preview 1 on your Xiaomi Poco F1. As you can see, I do have the Poco F1 running MIUI 11.0.4.0 based on Android 10. Will this work if you are on MIUI 11 based on Android Pi? I'm not sure on that, but I'm pretty sure it will work if you are on MIUI 11 based on Android 10. What are the prerequisites for this video? The prerequisites for this video are you need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have a special version of Dwarf Recovery installed, which is linked in the description of the video. Next thing you need to make sure is that your device is decrypted. How do you find that out? You go into settings, password and security, privacy, as you can see, encryption and credentials, phone not encrypted, which means my phone is decrypted. How do you decrypt your Poco F1? I have a separate video for that, which is linked in the description of this video. Another thing you need to make sure is that your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent. Do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent. Also make sure you have a backup of all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device because if we run into any issues, boot loops, anything like that, we'll have to do a format data in which case you're going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Those things out of the way. First thing you need to do, go into settings, password and security, remove your password, fingerprint unlock and face unlock. Once that is done, you'll go back, go into me account and remove your me account. Next thing, go back, go into accounts and sync and remove your Google account. Once you've removed all the accounts and security measures, make sure, and I repeat, make sure you reboot your device once just to make sure that all the accounts and security measures have been removed successfully. Next thing you need is an application called Z archiver and what are the files which we need all the files which we need are linked in the description of the video and these are the two files which you need you need the pixel 4 rom zip file and then you need the ab android 11 or android r gsi image file this file will be in dot 7z format which is why we need to use the archiver all you need to do is tap on the file and then select extract here. Once you do that, the file will be extracted as a .img file with the same name. Next thing we need to do is boot into twerp recovery. So for that, the first thing we need to do is turn our device off and then press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the twerp recovery boot logo. Once we have booted into twerp recovery, we'll go into wipe, select advanced wipe and then select Talvik cache system vendor and data. And if you tell me that you do not see the option of vendor, that is because you're not using the version of twerp recovery, which is linked in the description of this video. Once you have selected all the partitions, you need to swipe to wipe. Once that is done, you'll click on the home button, go into install. And now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the pixel 4 rom zip file for the poco f1 all you need to do is select the file and then swipe to confirm flash once the pixel 4 rom has installed successfully we'll click on the home button going to reboot and select system it is giving us a message that no os is installed are you sure we will just select swipe to reboot and there it is we do have the pixel 4 rom boot animation which means our device is booting into the pixel 4 rom so we are on the setup screen of the Pixel 4 ROM. Let me skip the initial setup real quick. And now if we go into settings and then go into about phone, you will see that our phone is being detected as the Google Pixel 4. And if I click on the Android version, you will see that I am now running Android 10. Next thing we need to do is we need to boot back into Twerp Recovery. So we're going to turn our phone off and then press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till we see the Twerp Recovery boot logo. Once we are in twerp recovery, we'll go into install, select install image, swipe down and now you need to navigate to the folder where you have extracted the .img file for Android R or Android 11. We'll select the file on the next screen, select system image and then swipe to confirm flash. Once Android 11 
developer preview one system image has installed successfully all we need to do is select reboot system and bam there it is you can see our boot animation is no longer the dark pixel 4 rom boot animation it is a white boot animation which means we are booting into android 11 on our poco f1 this boot up might take some time so you have to be patient there it is internal problem with our device no thank you google click on ok click on ok one more time on the home screen wi-fi working like a boss and we can also go into settings and then we'll go into about phone and as you can see our device just rebooted how do you fix this this will keep on going if you boot back into android 11 it will keep on rebooting to fix this all you need to do is once you are on the screen click on ok click on ok one more time and now we need to force reboot into top recovery so just press and hold volume up and power button at the same time your device will forcefully reboot into top recovery once we are in top recovery we'll go into mount select system and vendor click on the home button go into advanced file manager scroll down go into vendor and select the overlay folder then click on the check mark button on the bottom right select delete swipe to confirm once that is done click on reboot system and we will boot back into android 11 on our poco f1 and this time we should not have any issues with rebooting again problem with our system you just need to click on ok click on ok one more time and unlock the device go into settings about phone pixel 4 android version is android version r the sim manager keeps on closing close the application android version r in the building tap on r multiple times nothing happens but we are successfully running android 11 developer preview one on our poco f1 now before you ask me what is working what is not working well irfan just released this gsi image a few hours ago i haven't had any time to play with it i just got it to boot so i decided i'll make a video for you peeps and i do encourage you to keep an eye out on the pinned comment because i'm going to update that with what is working what is not working any post installation patches which you might need and there it is peeps that is how you install android r or android 11 developer preview one on your poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you